welcome back to Broken, How to Break a Chair, Day 2. So yeah, the time has come, and it rained overnight, so it's kind of like dusty, and I also have this thing that we'll do future episodes of How to Break a Rusty Old Razor Scooter in the later episodes. But yeah, let's get started. So the first thing that I really want to do is obviously hit the ramp. Well, we did that in the last episode, but not as you were thinking. So. Oh my god, I think we might have to do it like this, this way, like that. There we go. That's why I call breaking a chair. And yesterday when I found this chair, and I thought I could make a YouTube video. Maybe one of the things would be sitting on it. But it's pretty much already broken. Like, look at this. It doesn't even work. Alright. Another way to break a chair, a rusty old chair, is throwing it in the grass. I think we should do that. Alright, here we go. So, turn it again. Here we go. I think that's good enough. Plus, the concrete's right there. It fell off. So, uh, yeah, I think that's another broken chair argument. And, oh, I can't seem to get it up. This is the beautiful glory of the chair. Another way to do it is kick it backwards. So we're actually going to place it right here. All right. Kicking it backwards. Three, two, one, go. All right. I think that's good enough broken chair all right see y'all later bye welcome back to broken how to break a chair day two so yeah the time has come and it rained overnight so it's kind of like dusty and i also have this thing that we'll do future episodes of how to break a rusty old razor scooter in the later episodes but yeah, let's get started.